Now these guys are fast. And he knows it. Oh gosh, okay. Helicopters, helicopters, blah, 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 blah. For the last month, non-stop helicopters. This is the only blade rotor system propeller you ever have to worry about, you ever have to care about. Not being that serious, but still though, oversaturation of helicopters. Helicopter here, helicopter there. I am now a full-fledged helicopter. You catch my drift. There's a lot of oversaturation. It's not a bad thing. People are excited about the new uh, vehicles coming into the game, but I thought with the first video from patch 1.81, we could step back and play a plane that that I hold dearly in my heart. And I'm sure a lot of old school jet players and well, this is a rocket. I really wonder when they're going to model. Golly boys, 1700 kilograms of force with this thing weighing fuck all. I really wonder what it would be like if this thing had, you know, like a rocket exhaust and sounded like a rocket. It'd be so much cooler. And with War Thunder updating the sounds and everything and the engine, I I, I can't wait till this thing leaves an awesome car or awesome exhaust. I would like to introduce you to the ME 163B-0. This is the new German jet or rocket at 8.3 and for some good reasons, at least before we take it into the action. Now, the B-0 is actually the pre-production from the ME-163 that we already know. This is pre-production of this. So it's kind of weird how the BRs are done, but so far, I kind of agree. The thing is, 8.3 is not even a... This is the first 8.3 in the game, to my knowledge. So it's going to be interesting. What kind of matches are we going to get up? Hopefully, we don't get up br all the time. Because 49.0s, granted, it's not the worst in the ME163. But it'd be nice to, you know, club. You know, Germany suffers. Now, if this ME163 is looking a little more pointy than normal, or a little more offensive, your eyes do not deceive you. The big selling point of this ME163 is its guns. So instead of the 30 mil, the ME163 is equipped with the 20 mil, the MG151. And the benefits the benefits of this gun is that one, it has more ammunition, two, it's accurate, more accurate to shoot, and three, it's higher velocity. It was still doing some pretty good damage on enemy planes. Now, the snapshots might not be as much compared to a 30 mil but uh, the medium shots will be much easier to achieve with the high velocity or the higher velocity MG151. And then if you see even more points in things sticking out, your eyes definitely do not deceive you. If the two guns are not enough, then you can go with the times two cannon. Granted, it doesn't take these off if you don't have them equipped. As you can see here, we didn't have them equipped and they're still there, but it just gives you the ammunition amount. We have a pretty darn big penalty on our turn time, at least just on stat card, but I believe that this additional gun weight and ammunition weight will you know, make our plane less maneuverable. So more firepower, I guess, equals more responsibility. What we'll do is that we're gonna take out the ME163 with the 420 mils, so blaze it. Smoke weed every day. We do have some pretty cool camos for this. Red Baron I was checking out, this one looks great, but it's, it's so cliche. I think, God, that is just pretty to me, guys. I don't know. White just looks really, really good. It's like a ghost, man. It's like, you know, we're really scary. Oh, almost forgot. We are streaming right now. Links in the description below. You can save this video. You can watch this video. Hop on the stream. But we are live. We are playing the whole patch today. We're playing with new helicopters and everything. Having a good old time. Just want to let you guys know. Okay. Without further ado, let's... uh. Let's go uh, uh, schnell, let's go schnell, schnell. And welcome to Kuban. Here we go. We're gonna take a right. Oh, and then the, guys, the new sound effects are here. They sound amazing. The ambient sound effect on the ground when you're in a tank is just beautiful. It sounds like there's an aircraft outside your house. 
God, they are loud though. Planes are so loud. Remember when like the sound effect was like shoot. <laughs> You guys, if you guys remember that, let me know in the comments below. But like, a plane would like fly near you and just be like, shoo. <laughs> shoo. <laughs> okay, we're gonna get up to, okay, never mind. We're already fast enough. The problem is this map's pretty big, so we're gonna extend our um, building up airspeed here. I think they've given the, uh, the, the prop a little more animation. Can you see it in here? Nope, unfortunately not. This, yeah, this is how it's this is how it's powered. Such a stupid joke, but I don't know why it's so funny. I absolutely love the performance of this thing. It's so unique to the game. I love the Germans' retarded wonder weapons. Okay, FJ, he's a little too low for us, but we'll descend. At the same time, that strategy we kind of did, you know, wasn't 100% historical, but it's it's. They just flew up, they climbed, they spent their fuel, and they, they glided, and they killed, and then they came back down to land. Role playing at its finest. Okay, full power. Look at the acceleration. Okay, check six. F28. Don't worry, our engine's still good. Little rusty with those guns, but once we got them on target, they completely shred it. Okay, we do some power here. Don't need to be this fast. Don't want to go heads up. Actually, geez, we probably could go heads up. That guy's dead. Yep. Okay, let's slow down here. Flaps. Jeez, the wheeze. This thing is so darn fast. Look at it abuse these guys. This is ridiculous. Where's that F-80 at? Oh. Where is their 9.0 aircraft at? Oh, gosh! We're chasing that guy. Now, we can't really catch him if he dives. But, um... We can catch him if he climbs, that's for sure. Oh, he's dead. Okay. I think I know why we all love the 163. Also, if you guys are looking for a first jet or rocket, I highly recommend the ME 163. It is so hard not to have fun with this. However, it doesn't teach you um, normal jet mechanics. Just keep that in mind. I think the reason why we love this jet rocket so much. Rocket. Is because if you respect two simple rules of not ripping your wings and not run out of fuel, you're going to have a good old time in it. A little altitude fight. We got clouds over us. Okay, everyone's just going to lemon in. We'll chase the Yak-30. We're going to anticipate his climb. He went back over, unfortunately. Got stealth rounds equipped too now. He is faster than us, but we have more acceleration. But he's already hit that quota. Stealth rounds. And we'll let the other 163s take over. Whoa, 17? Come back around. Oh, oh. Oh, I love this thing. 
Good play on the Yak-30 to disengage. And we'll sit in the clouds at 3.30 fuel. Another plane spotted. F2H will pop flaps. Actually, we'll pop some landing gear here. Look at that turn rate. Okay, we're tracking his dot. He's rolling over, unfortunately. Bad aim. You're missing that crucial part of your aircraft right there. That, that was a brutal scream. Back up we go. Two minutes of fuel left. And we'll hold it here. This might not be a good idea. It could pay off. But we're going to waste a lot of fuel burning for this guy. And if he employs the same tactic as before, which is running away, it's not going to be worth it. But let's see if it is. Okay, that's, not, that's enough speed right there. Killed himself, but got the kill. Now, we could, you know, make it in. Or we could stay up the whole game and get the two kills. But just to, for, just for the safe play, we're going to go back and get some more fuel. Okay. Combat. Wow. Confirmed. Key 200 is powered by a prop. You got to be extremely slow when you come in. Sounds like a V1, dude. Uh-oh. What was that? What is that? Oh, gosh. Oh, 19 seconds. Go! Go for that guy over there! That's a strategy. Especially when you're in the Meteor. And you know a lot of the team's 163s. Oh. Are you a B model? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's always the tricky part. At the same time... Oh, jeez. Hang on. He's, he's doing a turnaround. The thing has really good turn rate. Oh, he's like, I fucked up. I fucked up. Ooh, God, that stealth, that AP-80 man in the stealth belt is marvelous. It literally goes into the aircraft, then explodes. Looks like a tank shell. Wow, okay. This is a really good BR. Now, we're going to be a little low of fuel. Wow, wow, okay. There goes the, the pretty much probably about 20% of their team. Uh, Why not again, huh? Uh, let's see what happens here. He's slowing down new maneuvers. The MiG-17, the MiG-15 might miss. God, we didn't even hit him that much. Oh, gosh! Going to land. I didn't think I was going that fast. Okay.
Oh, this is going to be interesting. I don't think it's going to work, but... We'll try it. <laughs> you know what? We're going to get a better setup. We got two minutes. We can do this. I didn't feel like I was going that fast to rip. Easy, buddy. You're okay. Oh, wow. That is the quickest game I've ever seen. Okay, we'll get in another one. I really wanted to know if I could land that. I wish you could stay in the game just for a little bit. That doesn't make any sense. The uh, 163 is a touchy little bird. Sometimes you can pull 13 Gs. Goodbye, goodbye uh, G91. Sometimes you can't pull 10. It's a... Uh, it's an intricate system. Now, what's this F2H going to do here? Probably nothing. Just stay linear and uh, keep doing those maneuvers. Oh, guys, you got to go with the stealth belts. It's so quick to kill. Okay, soft pulls here. Still got four minutes of fuel, roughly. And there's still, golly, like eight players that haven't shown themselves. More like, yeah, well, now six players. Okay, you got F-84. Now, with this one, we're able to turn around here. Hopefully, he won't climb. Okay, well, he's dead. Okay, we'll idle that engine. Oh, here they are. They're all low to the ground. It's like you're not going to get the uh, the ME-163 in, in, in a climb. You're just not going to catch it. Okay, we're number two. Actually, number yeah, n number two, I would say, on this F... Number one now on this F-84. We'll lay off the uh, throttle here for a second. Okay, we got this nice turn. Jeez Louise. And honestly, you don't even need the other 20 mils. Okay, slow right turn. Oh, I think I know what happened. We were at high or low altitude when we pulled those Gs. That's game. I think. One more guy, maybe two more guys left. Here we go. Fully recharged, six minutes of fuel. This is gonna be interesting. Got a bomber up. Oh gosh, okay, we spotted him. We're gonna get, now nah, we're just gonna go right towards him. And then by the time we get there, we'll have enough airspeed to maneuver around. Good thing we just uh, got some more fuel. I don't know, it's moving as slow as a prop would. But it looks like a B-57 or a Canberra. Yeah, those big old wings. Yeah, B-57, I think. Okay. This is so much better than the 30 mil. So much better. Maybe it's just because our burst mass with the 420s. But I think it's just also that stealth round too.
Fellas, I hope you have enjoyed today's video. I will see you on the stream if it's still the same day this video is out. Fellas, again, hope you have enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace out.